Hi everyone, Melissa here, coming back to share the Queen of Craft products that I've been working with and I've made a few projects and it's a lot to show you so I'm just going to jump right in. Starting out with the nested label dies and those look like this, hopefully we won't get too much of a glare. So that's how that looks and I made two different things. I wasn't quite sure if I liked how the first one turned out, but I said I was going to use it. And there it goes. I just used it as a tag. I did add a little um, reinforcer on top and got for you on there. Put a birthday cake on there. So I'll be, use that, be able to use that for someone's birthday. And then the other one is just like an embellishment that I made. And there goes that there. Oh, hopefully you can see it. And that says hello friend there <laughs> and so those are the two items i made with that and then next up we will go with the candy box die and that looked like this and it's very it's it's definitely a lot smaller than what i had thought but it turned out really cute and i do have to um tell you I kind of struggled putting this together it shouldn't have been but um yeah but I love how it turned out though there it goes and it almost matches that I used the same paper so yeah this is really really cute all right so that was that um next up we have the bubble dye which looks like this and I, like I said, I was going to work with it. It was a little smaller than what I had anticipated, but I made a mini slimline die. Now, just to let you know, I do not drink. However, I had this in my stash. So my first time using this little martini glass. And so I thought I would just have that as celebrate, you know, a little bubbly, bubblies behind there. So, and that's how that looks. And I did finish off the inside of the card. And there goes that. Oh, the background paper, I used Distress Inks, if someone wants to know. And then um, and then these are the uh, diamond dots on there. Okay, next up, we have the uh, layering letter dies. And so this looks like this. There's several different dies behind there. And remember, I'll have all the links down below. So if you're interested in that, just click on those links. And here is what I made with this. And I thought it was really pretty. I um, put a butterfly down. I used some distress inks with a stamp that I had behind here. There goes that thinking of you. I did not use the uh, background part of that because I just wanted it to stand out just as it was. Added some uh, enamel dots on there. And I did add glossy accents as well to that thinking of you. And there goes the inside, which I did not finish it off. And I forgot to, but I will. <laughs> so there goes that one. Um, next up, we have the Blessing Words dies, and let me show you how those look. There we go, and um, I'll have that link down below. I think I put the wrong link on the other one because they have two sets that's called Blessing Word dies, but I'll try and remember to put the right one there. But this is what I made here. Added some flowers and a bow to that. And I used the Get Well Soon. I really like the font on that. And then just added some background dyes that I had in my stash. I finished off the inside of the card. Added some stickles on the flowers. And I used those dummy dots again. And then I added an enamel dot right there. I did glossy accent, but get, get well soon. So that is that one. And then next up, I am using the Hollow Flower Backdrop Dye. And that's this one here. Now I get did get inspiration from Pinterest for this one. And so um, here it goes. Pretty basic. I used two different color uh, whites. So I used like um, an off white or it's called Dove White, I believe from Michaels and then they're white. And so if you can see that that has two different color whites on there, add it, you made my day on there and then added some diamond dots on there as well. And I did finish off the inside of that card there. And then next up, and this is probably my favorite that I made. When I say I love these 
um, stars and they are called the Lace Star Dies. I love that little um, scallop border and, and as well as the little dots that are on there. So, so cute. Oh, I really, really like that. And so here is what I made here. This one is also inspired by Pinterest. And so um, I, what I, what I did was I laid that, um, the biggest one down and cut it into the white paper. And then I cut the other one out and used some um, oxide inks for that and just layered that right on top. I used my little uh, stamp that um, it's like paint, paint splatter stamp and popped down some enamel dots and I added a little banner thing up in the corner and called it done. I really like this one, so cute. And I added one of those stars right in the inside as well. And I mean, I tell you that scallop is so tiny. I love tiny scallops. And then you can see those little dots so well going around there, love it. And then the last one I am using is the rose background eyes. And that is that one. And I thought I would use my dist Distress Oxide inks again. And I just colored up, up a piece of paper, colored it all up. Um, and I used several different colors, as you see. And as it started to blend, you can just, uh, you know, see the blended colors there. And um, added beautiful on top of that, added some butterflies. These are their little gems that I got from Queen of Craft. Pop some of those down and then put stickles to finish it all off. I really like that. I did cut this out in glitter paper, so I tried to match that up. And then I believe I finished the inside. Yes, I did. And there it goes. I really like how that one turned out. All right, so like I said before, I will have all of the links down below for all of these um, products that I'm using. And, and I'll try and remember to correct this link. If I forget to correct it, just look for um, blessing word dies in the search bar and, and then both of them should come up and then you'll be able to see which one I'm talking about. All right, so I'll have the link down below. I'll have my code. I wanna say it's Mo750. And uh, you can go over and get a, get a discount while you're shopping. All right, thanks so much, everyone. You all have a blessed and crafty day. Stay safe out there.